We are using live sucker as bait today. I am fishing the Great Miami River with my dad, my older brother, and a special guest, Dave, here. This is kind of Dave's territory. And uh, as you can see, we're fishing a uh, rundown, torn down railroad trussel. And as you can see, so much structure. We have log jams, we have concrete pillars. Uh, so this will be an excellent place to fish for some flatheads, and that's what we're gonna be going for. So stay tuned. There you go. That's a good one right there. Oh, yeah. So I'll go over the top of you. We were using live and cut sucker to try and catch a flathead. I've never used this type of bait before. Typically I use bluegill or skipjack to catch flatheads in Tennessee, but we were fishing in Middletown, Ohio on the Great Miami River, fishing a train trussel, as you can see, and it's a lot of structure, a lot of log jams, concrete pillars, very attractive for flatheads to be hanging around but unfortunately the bite was pretty slow we only fished for about a few hours and only got one flathead my older brother Alan ended up catching his first ever flathead and actually ended up being his personal best catfish weighing around 17 pounds I'm gonna go and show you that enjoy the rest of the video think it's a channel I don't know it might be a flathead the way he's yeah holding it Alan this could be your fish get ready here. Yeah. I think that's a small flatty. And he ain't moving at all. I think he's gone. He might yeah. be gone. I wonder if he's swimming it at all like upstream. Yeah. Think he's still on there? Uh, feel him right now. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. Give he's a couple cranks. Just give yeah. a couple cranks. Just I, I, one. I one oh, more. he's on there. Yeah. I'm going to go ahead and get yeah, him. Yeah, there you go. Hold on, Jackson. I got oh. Got him. <laughs> We've got on, action. Man. We got action. <laughs> nice man. There you go, Alan. I try to bring him down this way a little bit, keep him out those lines. Yeah, so kind of reel down, Alan, then kind of pull up. Now to just stop reeling and, and pull up a little bit. You there you go. Yeah. Now as you reel it, drop it down as you reel it in. That's it. Now you pull up. So it's coming in, right? Yeah, it may be a channel. That might be. He's kind of heavy. He's coming. He's coming. He's pretty far out. Let's see what he looks like. Oh, that's a nice that's flatty. A nice that's a nice flat. Okay, stop. Stop right there, Alan. Stop right there. Yeah, that's what I was saying. He fell down. Pretty right. good sized nice. fish. Let me see. Yeah, he swallowed that too. Daddy. Yeah, he's look at, look at that. Yeah, let's clip yeah, that. Yeah, Nice flathead, guys. This is Alan's first ever flathead. Come here, buddy. Nice. Okay, so here's what you're going to do now, Alan. Let me get the flashlight. You're going to release him back in the water, okay? Okay. So go ahead and put tail in first, okay? Don't let go of don't let go with your right hand okay. though. Yeah. He's okay. Right there. There you go. Go ahead and let him go. Hold on, not just yet. Worry about holding his mouth that. He'll be okay. Like that. They didn't help him out that long. There he goes. He's bolted. All right, guys. The bite's been pretty slow. But we did get my older brother Alan on his personal best catfish. So we're going to go ahead and call it a night, guys. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you in the next episode. If you guys like watching that video, please be sure to check out some of our other videos here on the Chat Cats Fishing Channel. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button, and thanks for watching.